Endomasters is a training course like no other. The basic reason is it is a truly multidisciplinary forum, both in the faculty as well as in the audience. So everybody who comes to Endomasters is an expert in their own field, whether it's vascular surgery, interventional cardiology, or interventional radiology. So it creates the perfect forum for open discussion open discussion on a very complex subset of patients in which there is no algorithm or consensus agreement. I think the way this program is different is honestly I like the short concise length of it because then we really just focus on one area and in this case more of like complex case management and kind of energy wise be able to just put our focus in that for two days and, and have a good result. It's uh, fantastic, it's phenomenal, uh, because the thing with endovascular work, it's, it's kind of thought of as a wild, wild west out there. Things are not very algorithmic. So it's nice to have um, a good selection of faculty from various backgrounds. We have interventional cardiologists, we have radiologists, we have vascular surgeons. And everybody brings a good perspective to the table, and it's nice to learn from these different fields and what they have to offer. My thoughts on this program is uh, very uh, informative. They have good algorithms to go by. They taught uh, different types of accesses that I wasn't aware that were being performed throughout the nation. And it's very informative to me. This program is really spectacularly different from other programs because of its ability to offer hand-on experience on cadavers. This is absolutely amazing. I've never seen this in 30, 40 years that I'm in practice. We were very competently able to visualize the complex arteries, not me, and able to learn uh, hand-on. And this really is single-handedly the best. I think the best way to ensure a good learning environment at Endomasters is, is that they really take time to have a good multidisciplinary discussion of all the aspects of arterial disease and peripheral arterial disease. I think also there's no bias in terms of what products somebody has to discuss or to use. Basically every company, every product related to what we do in peripheral arterial disease interventions is on the table. And I think that really creates a, a really relaxed, unbiased and kind of data driven uh, course. I don't do a lot of industry sponsored events. Um, I find them to be commercially biased. This was not, um, and it basically covered the whole gamut of different offerings from different companies and had an excellent group of moderators that really uh, dug deep into really controversial areas, tibial, uh, tibial interventions, acute limb ischemia, and a whole bunch of stuff. So it was uh, really worth, worth my while and definitely worth you know, coming across the country for it. I would recommend this program to any of my colleagues um, as everybody can learn a new technique and make themselves even better. I would recommend it to a colleague. I mean, I think especially due to the, the time constraints that a lot of us have, having it like focal on a weekend is, is very useful. To kind of pack it all in and, and get some good benefit very quickly. Absolutely, I would recommend that program. And I'm probably gonna attend more than once, like, you know, this program, like over the next few years, because it keeps you updated. It keeps you updated with new technology and new approaches. So absolutely.